Welcome back everybody to Jason's Detail Tips. We got a special episode here for you today. We get a lot of emails and personal messages on this subject and that's our chemical dispensing system. I'm here with my business partner Greg and he is the mastermind behind this whole system. So what he's gonna do, he's gonna explain how it works, why it works, and everything that you need to do to get your own system in your detail shop. That's coming up next on Jason's Detail Tips. Jason's Detail Tips. Hey guys, my name's Greg. I'm here to talk to you today about chemical proportioning systems. We have a chemical proportioning system behind us. It leads to dispensing systems in the bays. The reason you want one of these systems in your shop is to get rid of these. If you've ever worked in a shop and you know how much these bottles are a pain in the butt. They're always broken, they're never where you left them, or when you find them, they're empty. You gotta go refill them. So by adding a chemical dispensing system, you're gonna solve this problem you're gonna save yourself money on chemicals, you're gonna avoid waste, and you're gonna to lead to a lot of worker productivity. All right, we're here in front of the heart of the system. This is a, a chemical dispensing unit by a company called Zep, Zep Incorporated, and they call it their smart chamber system. Now there's nothing particularly smart about this, but it is nice and handy and it's a great looking unit. It's all in one piece on the wall here. You have one input for air, one input for water, so it makes it real simple, uh, easy to hook up, and it looks really professional hanging on the wall. The smart chambers work simply by taking in water, air, and chemical and mixing it together right here on the board. Mixing concentrated chemicals with water in your shop, a lot of these are, you know, it, they mix anywhere from five to, parts to one with water up to over 100 parts to one with water. That's a huge savings by not shipping water weight around. And generally, the concentrated chemical costs a lot less than buying ready-to-use chemicals. So you're saving money by mixing them here. You're also keeping employees' hands out of the chemicals. So you don't have any problems with people injuring themselves by getting concentrated chemicals on them. You're also guaranteeing that you get the same proportion, the same mix every single time so that your chemicals are always consistent and they work properly. All right, let's take a look at one of these uh, mixing chambers in detail. Water comes in through the top here. This is a simple proportioning vice, device called a hydraminder. Hydraminders are adjustable and they mix the concentrated chemical with water and put it into the storage tank. The storage tank is ready to use solution. It gets pumped out here through an air driven pump and you've got a pressurized line that you can run anywhere in your shop. This is real standard stuff in the car wash industry. If you're looking for one of these systems in your area, you can find a car wash distributor that should be able to help you with it. The one thing I like about these chambers right here from Zep Incorporated is they're nice and they're sealed and they're covered. A lot of manufacturers have open containers and stuff can fall in them. I once pulled a dead bird out of a smart chamber. Uh, these ones are a lot nicer because they're sealed. Okay, so here's where the chemical system works in the bay. We've got these great looking units here in the bay. They look professional. They're really organized and neat. The board itself is nothing more than a place to hang the hoses. This is a sexy piece of equipment right here. Diamond plate, it's all welded, but it's pretty expensive. You can make do with any L bracket that you hang on the wall, but this is awfully good looking. We've got all the standard chemicals that we use in the shop here online. All purpose cleaner, tire dressing, glass cleaner, and of course air, which we use a lot when we're cleaning. The guys won't have to look around for these chemicals. You always know where you left it. It's never empty. It's never incorrectly mixed. We use coil hoses. Coil hoses can be tough because they tangle together, but if you keep them spread out a little bit, it usually works all right. And if guys take good care of their stuff, this is an all right solution. I've never found anything better. If you use long hoses, they, they're never long enough and they coil on the floor and they look like a mess. You've got a couple of choices for guns here. Um, I like these all metal guns. We've got them in a couple of different types here. Plastic guns, the handles can break. They're a little bit cheaper, but a high quality unit like this works a lot better. We've got some different ones with Viton seals in it. Viton seals are chemical resistant seals and they hold up a lot better. Great looking gun, worth the money. This unit can be mounted on the wall. We use Unistrut. Unistrut is a common structural material. I think the electricians use it a lot. You can buy it at Home Depot. Unistrut's super durable. You cut it to length. It's easy to use. We use it all the time for mounting stuff around the shop. So how do you get the chemical to where you want to use them? These air-driven pumps pressurize a line. Now, in the industry, car wash industry, and in detailing, 
I found this Polyflow tubing. It's made by a company called Polyflow to be really easy to use. It's really flexible and it's really durable. It comes in a variety of colors and you can see we've got all different colors here. So you color code each product application. It's easy to run these lines around the shop. The connectors are made by a company called John Guest and they're easy push fit. You don't need a lot of tools. You need a cutting device and that's about it and a few zip ties and you can run this chemical anywhere you want in the shop. This is one of my favorite applications for one of these smart chambers. This is our foam cannon system. The foam cannon system uses the same inputs, air, water, and chemical, mixes ready to use soap together, and then in the gun here, you mix the air and the chemical, they come together and it's adjustable so you can get the right kind of foam you want, but they come together and gives you a great foam cannon. The advantage of this system, it's always the same dilution, it's always the same pressure so you get good consistent results, and savings and efficiency. So you can see here in the wash bay we've got three different types of chemicals and these are different from the stuff that we use in the other parts of the shop. We've got an acidic wheel cleaner for heavy duty wheel cleaning. We've got a great all-purpose cleaner that we use on uh, easy to clean wheels or if we've got heavy bugs. And we've got tire dressing which anytime we wash a car you want to put tire dressing on it. We also have once again air. Depending on the chemical that you're spraying you might want a different tip. Again all this stuff is adjustable. Here's a foaming tip by Spraying Solutions. This creates a nice wide pattern and it aerates the product so that you get foam instead of just liquidy solution. This is great when you're dealing with anything that you want foamed on the car. It helps it cling and keeps the product on the car for a little bit longer than if it was just a liquid. Once again, Spraying Systems, these are their standard tips. These tips come in all different sizes. You can adjust the width of the pattern depending on whether you want a narrow stream of chemical or whether you want a very wide stream of chemical and you can also control the size of the opening in these tips so that you get more chemical coming out or less depending on your application. Again, helping you control the usage. All of this stuff comes from the car wash industry where they do a lot of work getting chemicals to the car at the right place in the right time. So how much does it cost to put one of these in your shop? The savings are huge and I don't think you should discount that. Let's start with the smart chamber on the wall. These chambers are anywhere from $500 up to $1,000 per application. The one we have on the wall here has five applications on it. You can buy them individually or you can buy them all together as a set. Some companies will offer them cheaper, some are more expensive. You generally get what you pay for. In each detail bay, you're going to want to have a set of hoses on either side. Depending on where you get the stuff from, it's going to cost anywhere from $500 to $1,000 per side for those as well. Unistrut is commonly available at places like Home Depot. Uh, and then the last thing that you need to pull it all together is the polyflow tubing and connectors. They're reasonably cost effective and the length of the application is obviously going to have an impact on how much it costs. So why do you want to use a dispensing system like this? Well, there are several advantages. You're going to save money. Concentrated chemicals are a lot cheaper than buying ready-to-use chemicals. You're also eliminating a lot of waste. If guys are using the old style five gallon buckets with drums on them, they're spilling a lot on the floor, and if a little bit's gonna help them do their job, well then why wouldn't they use a lot more and try to get done twice as fast? You have a great appearance with this stuff. If you want your shop to look professional and neat, this is the way to do it. We have a lot of people come in here, a lot of customers, who notice the dispensing equipment, and it gives a real good impression that we're professional and that we're efficient. And efficiency is the third reason. Guys, the detailers love having the equipment right where they want it. They know it's always full, they never lose anything, and they're always ready to go. So if I were to take these away from my guys, well, nobody needs this disp dispensing system, everybody loves having it in the shop. So this should help you understand the basics of a dispensing system. If you want to try to install one of these and you're not comfortable with the equipment, try looking for a car wash distribution company in your area. They should be familiar with all this stuff and they can help you get the job done. So I'm Greg. Thanks for watching Jason's Detail Tips. Oh,